Okay. Hi. Happy Sunday, everybody. Happy Lord's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to everybody out there. And happy Daytona 500 Day to all you NASCAR fans. <laughs> Today is the great American race. The Daytona 500. The 2021 season has begun to will begin today <laughs> so just pray for all the drivers <laughs> have have a great race start the season off and may the best man win <laughs> is it going to be him or is it going to be a surprise winner <laughs> is it gonna be it's gonna be the teammate? Or not 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 this, but this. One four. Fourteen. <laughs> is it gonna be him? Is he gonna surprise everybody? First race out win it? <laughs> that then I would be, that would throw a loop through everybody. But I still say you give him a few races under his belt in that cup car and he should be in victory lane before you know it. So, But today we're going to be talking about the greatest love. For video number 265 for Sunday, February 14th. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. I just took a swallow of my drink just a few, a few seconds ago before starting this video. <sighs> Belching up my... Uh, Spaghetti. I had a few hours ago for like a breakfast. <laughs> yes, I eat spaghetti for breakfast sometimes when there's leftover. <laughs> Cause I only ate one one helping of it last night at dinner time. So for Thursday's dinner. Dang it! Come on, you stupid compute screen. Quit changing color on me. Just have to deal with it, I guess. Can't get it any closer to me. But the greatest love, Genesis 22, 2. 22, chapter 22, verse 2. It says, and he said, Take now thy son, thine only son Isaac, whom thou lovest, and get thee into the land of Moriah. Mor. Moriah. M O R I A H. And offer him there for a burnt offering upon one of the mountains, which I will tell thee of. So there are many types of love in the world. Happy Valentine's Day to all you lovers out there. Romantic love, marital love, erotic love, brotherly love, maternal love, patriotic love, family love, and love for all kinds of things pets food money sports and on and on there's a love for anything but what is the greatest love that's what we're going to be talking about today what is the greatest love so love is probably the greatest word of the bible and by the principle of first mention of important biblical words the first time the word love occurs should be a key to, to its use all throughout the Bible. And rather surprisingly, love is first encountered here in the verse we just read, Genesis 22, 2. Speaking of the love of a father for his son, of Abraham for Isaac, the son of promise. Excuse me. So furthermore, <clears throat> Sorry. The father is being told by the very God who made the promise to offer his beloved son as a sacrifice. So from the New Testament, see Hebrews 11, 17 and 18, we know that this entire scene is the remarkable type of the heavenly father and his willingness to offer his own son in a sacrifice for the sin of the world. This tells us that love of the human father for his human son is an earthly picture of the great eternal love of the Father in heaven.
for his only begotten son, Jesus. And that means that this love of God the Father for God the Son is the ultimate source of all love. For that love was being exercised before the world began. And when Jesus prayed to his Father the night before his sacrificial death, he confirmed this great truth. For thou lovest me before the foundation of the world, he prayed in John 17, 24. So indeed God is love, 1 John 4, 8. And the eternal love within the triune Godhead is the fountainhead of all true human love here on earth. So that tells you right there, that is the greatest love of all. The love from God the Father to God the Son. Eternal love is the greatest love of all. Amen? So that is all I have for today's Valentine's Day, Daytona 500 Day video <laughs> starting tomorrow in the first first of the new week for Feb Monday February 15th and video number 266 we are going we're going to be talking about the righteous in authority and we're going to be starting with Proverbs 29 verse 2 so I hope you enjoyed what you heard today hope you come come back hope you have a great Sunday Hope you have a wonderful week upcoming this new week. I love you. Appreciate you. Stay safe. Keep all those in prayer for ones that that need prayer that are battling this pandemic or they are sick and have battling a sickness other than the this pandemic. Cancer or any other other vile disease. Come back tomorrow, and we'll get on into the new week. I'll probably, from recording this video on Friday, I'll probably get sometime today, Sunday, and record the, re the next week's videos. So stay tuned for that. I love you, and I appreciate you. And with that said, peace out. Until tomorrow, everybody. Goodbye, God bless, and go Harvick. <laughs> I'll let you know someone the week who won. <laughs> have a great, have a great rest of your weekend, and have a good, and have a very blessed week, everybody. I love you all. Goodbye. <laughs>